Again, the reason for the snow day tomorrow for most students, the concern over slick roads tonight. NDOT is asking drivers slow down because the morning commute will be so tricky. Continuing our team coverage, 8 News Now reporter Shaquilla Alvarenga has been up and down the valley all night. Brian, that's right. There are some parts of the valley where you may see uh, some of those wet roads, and you'll definitely want to take it slow. So, if you do have plans to drive tonight, a quick piece of advice wet roads, they could quickly turn icy as the temperatures drop. And Dotted is urging uh, drivers to remain calm and avoid overreacting if you do encounter black ice. Do as little as possible and allow your car to pass over the ice. Do not abruptly hit your brakes and keep your steering wheel straight. We've already seen one bad. Crash tonight, and it wasn't weather related, but it's a reminder to be extra careful. After I got hit, like about like a second later, I think a ladder came flying down from the sky. I have no idea where that came from, but anyways, um, yeah, everything behind me was just a blur. I was really focused on what was in front of me. The only thing I really saw was uh, that car colliding with the van. Now, this crash happened right near Decatur and Tropicana around 8 o'clock tonight. Police say a car traveling north on Decatur in the third lane lost control and crossed seven lanes right into oncoming traffic, causing a seven car pileup. Now, one person was taken to the hospital, but their injuries do not appear to be life threatening. Now, back out here live, again, the biggest concern overnight it will be black ice. So make sure that you give yourself enough time to get to your destination in the morning. Reporting live, Shakela Alvarenga, 8 News Now, back to you.